when your Ream tankless water heater starts beeping, it's trying to tell you something important. These beeps are warning signs that indicate a problem with your system. The beeping sound is accompanied by error codes displayed on your unit's remote control or LED display. These codes provide crucial diagnostic information about what's wrong. Each error code points to a specific issue, making it the first step in troubleshooting. Let's look at the most common error codes you might encounter. Error code 11 indicates ignition failure. This means there's a problem with the ignition system, possibly due to a lack of gas supply or faulty ignition components. Error code 12 means flame failure. The system cannot detect a flame, which could be due to old or defective parts or issues with the flame sensor. Error codes 14 and 16 indicate overheating problems. This could be caused by a faulty temperature sensor, lime scale buildup, or restricted airflow. Error codes 05 and 90 point to combustion problems. These can stem from dirty air filters, blocked vents, or issues with the heat exchanger. Error code 29 indicates water flow issues. This could be due to problems with the water flow sensor, blockages in the system, or dirty filters. Always consult your REAM manual or online resources to understand the specific meaning of any error code you encounter. Proper identification is crucial for effective troubleshooting. Now that you understand the error codes, let's explore how to troubleshoot common issues and maintain your REAM tankless water heater for optimal performance. Let's start with troubleshooting the most common issues you might encounter with your tankless water heater. Here's the internal layout of your Ream tankless water heater. Understanding these components helps when troubleshooting issues. For ignition or flame failure issues, first check that your gas supply is turned on and the gas valve is fully open. Also ensure there are no obstructions in the venting system. For overheating problems, you'll need to check your thermostat settings and look for any error codes that indicate sensor issues. Here's what a dirty heat exchanger looks like. This mineral buildup can cause overheating and reduced efficiency. Combustion problems often stem from dirty components that need regular cleaning to maintain proper airflow and operation. This is an example of a dirty filter that needs cleaning. Debris buildup like this can restrict airflow and cause combustion issues. Water flow problems are often the easiest to fix by checking valves and cleaning filters in the water line. Compare this to a clean filter. Regular cleaning maintains proper water flow and prevents many common issues. Now let's discuss the regular maintenance practices that will keep your tankless water heater running efficiently and prevent most of these problems. Annual system flushing is crucial, especially in hard water areas. Use a white vinegar solution to remove mineral deposits that can reduce efficiency and cause overheating. Clean both water and air filters regularly. Water filters prevent debris from entering the system, while air filters ensure proper combustion airflow. Regular visual inspection helps catch problems early. Look for water leaks, pipe corrosion, or signs of component wear that could lead to failures. This image shows the type of corrosion and leakage you should watch for during inspections. Early detection prevents major repairs. Schedule annual professional service for comprehensive gas pressure testing, electrical connection checks, and thorough system inspection that goes beyond basic maintenance. Remember these critical safety points. Always turn off both power and gas supplies before performing any maintenance work on your tankless water heater. If you're uncomfortable performing any maintenance tasks, don't hesitate to contact a qualified technician. Proper maintenance will keep your Ream tankless water heater running efficiently for years to come.